Don't, 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 These are posters. And look how awesome they are. We printed them yesterday and they look amazing. See, this is me. This is Logan. This is known as they've all been perfectly annotated with classy speech bubbles. They look pretty damn cool. Sunday, insert your own pun day. That title is probably the greatest idea I've ever had. I will never have an idea better than that. So I kind of shot myself in the foot there. But on the bright side, I am very purple. And I look way cooler than the other two. But I can't really help that, because I am way cooler than most people. Yes, so we're going to be putting these up around the place today. It's going to be very good. So, I do remember saying that I would film us putting up the posters. But I didn't do that. Surprise. I should have done that because I distinctly remember that when we did put up the posters, uh, it was quite entertaining. There was a lot of wit and banter. Yes, that's how I describe it, wit and banter. Um, but no, I didn't film it. At the time I was like, why am I not filming this? Uh, but I think it's a case of there's some moments you just sort of have to live and like I didn't want it to feel too forced or something, I don't know. Or I was just too lazy. It is a shame though. Because as I said, there was there was wit and banter. But I'm sure there will always be wit and banter. That would be my hope. That when the world ends there will still be wit and banter. Apart from that, the reception for the posters has been quite positive, so that's good. Um, I feel like we should have got more bigger ones. We got more A4s and A3s, and at first that seemed like a fun idea, just because of transport, the A3s. But now, having put them up next to other people's posters, I'm like, ah. Oh. Ours might look cooler, but your poster is bigger, which might make all the difference. We must have faith in the color purple. Not the film. Maybe the film. Do you guys remember this idiot? I will do another one of these in the next five days. Let's say that. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Next five days. Five days. What an idiot. Oh my god. Why would I think I would do that? It's ridiculous. Five days. Uh... Yeah. That was foolish. It's very, very foolish of me to think that that was a was an option. It's 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 now been over two weeks since I said that. Um. So yeah, I don't know if it, I jinxed myself or I was just playing with powers beyond my beyond my kin. Anyway. I'm doing stuff now, I suppose. Uh, we're all on track. 
Um, which I'd hope so, because we've got very little time left before a saddle. Um, rehearsals are all good. Songs sound like songs. They just sort of need refinements. I'm not too worried about anything. The only sort of development um, is that uh, one song that needs a vocal looper and the one that I've sourced has turned out to be a lot more than just a vocal looper. It has so many features, like a ridiculous amount, and I feel like I have to rethink the song now to utilize those features, otherwise I'm just missing an opportunity. So yeah, now a song is sort of in the air as to what's gonna what it's going to become or what I'm gonna do with it. But I think it's a fun one near the top of the show, so I think it probably won't matter how much detail or little detail I put into it. But yeah. So yeah, all songs bar that one are, are like ready. That one's like gone into flux mode <laughs> but yeah if I can work out how to get good at using the machine then it should pay off I would hope it looks like I'm like in heaven like heaven sort of draped across my shoulders at the moment at this time of day or not heaven like just some kind of void like my flat's been transported into a void or maybe, I don't know, I'm being abducted, but it's taking ages. I, s I mean, it looks kind of cool, but at the same time, it also looks like something ethereal and otherworldly, which is not necessarily the theme of this vlog. Or is it? No, it's not. No, it's not that at all. Um, we... Finally, sort of sourced a drum kit. I'm having trouble getting a a full kit. Like we've been looking for a whole kit for a while, but everyone we talked to was like, "I've got good cymbals but shitty snare, or I've got shitty toms but a good kick." And we were like, "Well, this is getting more and more complicated as we go along." So we decided that we might need to Frankenstein a kit together with all these good parts. But we also weren't certain if we had collected all the parts we needed. But I just checked out a kit and I think it's got everything we need. It's not perfect. Um, I think some of the heads need tightening, tightening. I hope that's what they need. Otherwise, I don't know what to do about how boomy they are. It's funny. I went to the kit and started testing it and constantly kept coming back to the thought of I'm not actually an expert on drum kits I'm just hitting them and seeing if they sound good maybe that's how you become a drum expert maybe it's a lie no one knows anything we just hit things and say whether they sound good or not um, yeah Kidding things. distinctly a rehearsal from possibly almost a month ago now as we've already established I took way longer to do another vlog 
so that's why that's the case. Um, so yeah, that that song that you just heard, like it's a lot more complete now. That's obviously without vocals or clean um, guitar, but it I don't know it sounds good, like. And it should do, because that song I probably wrote first, or I wrote the bits of it first, like the riff that you heard, I wrote ages ago for a different song. Didn't even know it would be part of the recital. <coughs> um, yeah, I think, I don't know, tell me whether that sounds cool. And if you want to hear the rest of it, you have to come to the recital if you are local. If you don't, I don't know, maybe I'll try and record some of these properly after recital. Why not? Yeah. Um, what else? Alright, ready? Two, four. Yep. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four.